First of all, is my mic on? All right, so the first thing that I picked up is this super cool Adidas bucket hat right here. I think I picked this up like a week or two ago. This is super fire. It's like a nice little navy blue with the Adidas on it. I think it's fire. I'm really into uh, bucket hats. I got quite a few, I'm not gonna lie, it's my thing. There's pictures of me when I was mad young wearing bucket hats, so I guess it was just something that I've always been into. This hat is super fire. I think it was like 25, 30 bucks, super cheap. Check out your local sneaker stores and you'll be able to find some cool shit like this. Next thing that I have to show you guys is this brown and black hoodie from the brand Dope. You know what I'm saying? They were really popping a couple years ago. I'm not sure what about now, but Listen, I got this and I think it's pretty fire, so I mess with it. If you guys are looking for some new dope, go ahead and uh, check out their website. I got this hoodie in a size... I got this hoodie in a size large, and it does have that big boxy fit that I love, but I know a lot of you guys love too. So um, yeah, go ahead and uh, go ahead and check out some dope. Another thing that I have to show y'all, hit up the thrift store and I picked up this vintage Izod looking button up Philano right here, super cool, with the forest green, the peach, the Carolina blue, and the navy blue also. This is super fire. If I wanted to take off this, this other thrifted button up right here, I could, and then throw this on, and this would be a fire fit. I don't know how I'm really feeling about the, the short sleeve flannel with the, I'm kinda, I'm kinda messing with it. I don't know, it's, it's something different for me. All right, so the next thing for this clothing haul, I have to show y'all this Nike hat right here. And you guys probably might have seen me wear this in a couple of videos, but I just haven't shown you guys it. This is a nice little Nike hat that I got from a sneaker store. One thing that's cool about this hat is that it looks mad vintage and it already looks pre-worn. Honestly, that's probably because I wore it a lot. But the more you wear this hat, honestly, the better it looks to me. So, you know, I mess with it. I think this hat super fire. I love it. Another hat that I have to show y'all that you guys have probably seen also is this Atlanta Braves, you know, strap back right here. You know, in my opinion, I'll wear strap backs, I'll wear fitteds, I'll wear snapbacks, I'll wear visors as long as it's fresh, I'll wear it. This is a lit hat. This this hat damn near goes with anything. I go if I wanted to throw this hat on with this fit right now, I could throw this hat on with this fit right now and i'd be super duper duper fresh also i got on this with the light wash denims and i also got on the air jordan 21. a lot of people sleep on the jordans past 14 bro hold on everybody sleeps in the jordans past 14 bro do not sleep on the air a hey, focus 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 do not sleep on the air jordan 21s bro the cdp 21s really in love with this shoe i have a crush on this shoe i've had a crush on this shoe since i was like 17. I love it. Mm, 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 mm. I hope it loves me back. Who hit me up? So are we going to see each other today? Man, leave me the fuck alone. All right, so another thing I have to show you guys is this super cool Adidas bucket hat right here. The the all black Adidas bucket hat with the, with the Love Unites smack dab in the center of it. I like it. I like the colors, man. That's like a lavender purple. A nice little violet bluish purple the, with the purple and the orange and the you know what i'm saying all the colors you know look at that focus real quick bro look at all that that's lit i love it i love it i love it you can put this together with some cool fits which i have um maybe i'll just do a fit video bro another thing that i have to show you guys for this clothing haul is this super fire bucket hat right here like this is just what now maybe you guys have seen this maybe you guys haven't but yeah, I'm about to put y'all on game real quick. This is a Nike bucket, and it has the Nike logo kind of like in cursive. And I love it, bro. It looks so fire. This is like a tennis type of mesh type of material. Um, It's hard keeping this hat clean, so I can't really wear it the way I want to because this bad boy will get dirty quick. But at the same time, it's clothes. You should wear your clothes, bro. It don't matter if the clothes get dirty, bro, as long as you dripped out and you're wearing them, bro. I love it. Then if you look on the inside, it also has this little plaid print on the inside of it. And you can also, you can flip this motherfucker inside out and wear it like that too. I think this is a little wild. I wouldn't do that. But you know, I, you know, this, this hat is fire bro like no cap i could honestly be swagged out wearing this i wouldn't nah i wouldn't wear it with that fit. the next thing i picked up is another hat it's a 
a Nike Air hat right here. I think I got this hat for like five dollars, bro. It says Nike Air on the back of it. Super fire. Yeah, if I want, if I could definitely pull this hat off with this fit if I wanted to. But super fire, super, super duper fire Nike Air hat right here. Now another piece of fire that I have to show you guys is this nike zip up right here this nike track jacket in black and white i got this one in the size large and it fits me it fits me really good so if, if i wore it it's not a big fit but it's a it's a like a, a fitted type of fit but i really mess with it i love this a lot it's just a nice cool simple look if you're trying to be on cozy status to throw that on maybe throw in a hat maybe don't throw in a hat and just keep it moving i think i remember i remember one time i wore this with some gray pants and i wore this hat and i was in the grocery store and somebody said i like easy e. like i had an easy e fit on but at the same time freshest nigga there no cap all right so i got some other things that i have to show you now i have to show you these quick little champion sweatpants that i have had for a little while i just haven't shown you guys them i got these for the low low like like 10 bucks bro Nice little champion sweatpants. These came out probably sometime 2019, bro. 2020, you, you can't be so sure. But these are definitely fire. I got these in, what, a size large. They have, like, that big fit to them. If you guys watch any of my sneaker reviews, you might see those sweatpants make a, make a little return or whatever. But another thing that I got is this champion hoodie, too, you know. It has champion embroidered going all around it right here. And it also has like this gold metallic hit. Really cool. It gives me like a, a Letterman jacket vibe. That's something that I am definitely messing with. Like I said, bro, when it comes to brands, if, if, it, if the shit is fire, I'll wear it. No lie. It could be a fire brand. It could be Nautica. It could be Polo. It could be Nike. It could be Lacoste. It could be... Eddie Bauer, bro. Like, it could be anything. It doesn't matter. It could be Perry Ellis. It don't matter. I don't care. Like, if it's fire, I'm throwing it on, bro. I, I don't know. Like, all right. So, some other things that I do have to show you guys now. If you guys have been in tune to the gaming content I've been dropping on the channel also, then you guys might have seen some of these. So I've been wearing them a bunch. But we have this blue Columbia hoodie right here, which is fire. In my opinion, you can never have too many hoodies. The more hoodies you have, the better because the, the more fits these can go with. Gives me a, a Gore-Tex type of look. Also, another hoodie is the black and red North Face hoodie right here. Super fire. I, got, I think I got this hoodie for like 10 bucks. And this is a large. And the other thing, this is Columbia hoodie right here in the yellow. And uh, yeah, this one speaks for itself, man. Gore-Tex look all day super fire i love it now when it comes to columbia columbia is fire also you can go to macy's you can go to belk dillard's and you can find like the columbia zip up jackets you can also go to thrift stores or play-dohs find some columbia zip up jackets for mad cheap also so do not sleep on columbia and i i, I already know y'all not sleeping on north face now in this clothing haul another thing that i have to show you guys is this super cool cool gray four jordan hoodie right here now i don't think anybody's really seen me wear this one unless you on instagram this is the hoodie that was supposed to come out with the cool gray air jordan 4. um i had the chance to get the cool gray 4s but i just had the pass you feel me but i picked up on the hoodie i picked up the hoodie and the um so what i just showed you was the hoodie this is also the pants that went with that went with the uh air jordan 4 cool gray these right here, nice little gray pants, nice little cool gray four emblem on the left. And then if you take it down to the bottom, this is where we get funky. This is where we get jazzy, you feel me? We get lit. Yeah, super fire, super dope. I honestly didn't end up getting the cool gray fours at all, but I ended up getting the um, the the actual fit for like, what, 20 bucks? It's lit, bro. Uh, I don't know, like, I feel like Nike and Jordan, they got a lot of basic ass clothes, but they got a lot of fire shit. They have pieces, you know? I feel like in every Nike or Jordan catalog, there's always a couple pieces in there where it's like, you know what? I might need to take that home. There's a lot of just regular graphic tees that's just, same with Nike too. A lot of just regular graphic tees that I might not necessarily be into, 
but there might be an actual suit that's mad fire or there might be an actual hoodie that's like a collaboration type hoodie same thing with pants and you know looking for like the the low-key collector's items you feel me all right so the next thing for this clothing haul i have to let me just take that out the way i have to show y'all this super cool air jordan 11 hoodie right here which is the black red and white with the black jordan going through it i'm gonna be honest with you i'm gonna be honest with you bro this is it's a little head ass okay it's a little head ass okay it's, you know, it's a little like, it kind of reminds me of emoji pajamas. You feel me? It kind of, just a little bit. It's a little bit, it's a little childish. But at the same time, I like it. I fuck with it. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm aware because I like it. I also got the pants to match. I don't know where the pants are though. They're somewhere. Next time I find them, I'm going to just, you know what I'm saying? Another thing that I have to show y'all because th this is a pretty big haul. I'm not going to lie to you. Pretty big haul. Another thing I have to show y'all is this super cool bucket hat right here. If you guys were on my Instagram like the summer of like the quarantine of 2020, you would have seen this bucket hat all the time. I love this shit and I low-key forgot I had it. This shit was just right here. I love this hat. Oh my God. What? Bucket hat galore, buddy. Dang, bro. Bucket hat galore. This hat is actually really fire. It's like this weird, dirty wash. Like this hat looked like this when I bought it. That That's why it's fire. You know what I'm saying? I love it. I fuck with it. You know what I'm saying? I'd, I'd, I'd wear it with this, but just in a different type of way. That hat is fire. Another hat that I picked up is this Yankee hat right here with the... uh with the navy blue roses. I'm loving it, I'm messing with it, I'm loving it. It's a, it's a cool strap back. That hat will go perfect with this fit. No, no cap C's. Honestly, it wouldn't. I'd have to switch up the shoes. I'd have to take the 21s off. Maybe throw some, maybe throw some calm day garçons on. Or maybe, could I do it? Could I throw on the flint? Could I throw on the flint sevens? Could I do it? Maybe I could, I don't know. But, you know, I got this super cool New era Yankee strap bag. I haven't even worn it much, but uh, I, I might start wearing it. Another thing I got is I got this trasher hat. You know, relative came over, just dropped this bad boy off. And I was like, you know what? I might just have to take that. So I mess with it. I don't have too much thrasher shit. I don't have, that's honestly the only thing thrasher I have. I just think it's a cool hat. And then I also have this super interesting bucket hat right here it's like the american flag red white and blue but then if you look on the inside you know bow yeah pretty lit so on the fourth of july if you want to get turned you can really get turned with this bad boy right here this is actually a nike bucket hat if you guys pay attention you guys see the nike swooshes all around this side of the hat is way better than the inside of the hat i'd rather just have you be able to look at the inside of the hat instead of you know this is fire though definitely pretty lit i got this hat for like six dollars the last thing i have to show you for today's clothing haul there's a whole bunch more shit i gotta show you but this is just for right now the last thing i have to show you is this navy blue a negro leagues hat now i would be lying if i told you i knew what team this is don't be mad at me it's from the negro leagues i should know especially since i love sports i love boxing basketball baseball i don't really love baseball but football all of that and i know a lot of my history i should know this but this hat is fire as hell it says the negro leagues on the back it got the a stitched in and it's a fitted and this is a navy blue hat you feel me i fuck with it so i feel like this is what you call versatility thank y'all for watching as always hey bro this has been my my nice little clothing haul hopefully you guys have enjoyed it i've been putting in all kinds of work on the youtube a lot of the content that i'm dropping might not necessarily be content that you're all the way interested in but just because i don't drop something that you might remember that i did doesn't mean that i won't drop it again sometimes when it comes to creation and when it comes to just getting things you move into things and you move out of things one minute you might be in the clothing the next minute you might be in the gaming the next minute you might be in the bike riding and fighting and mma and boxing life is life is full of many things so you should try as many things as you can you feel me and when you want to be a jack of all trades then you might just your your taste might change consistently over time that's all that is but 
Thank y'all for watching as always. More videos coming soon. More bangers coming soon. I urge you guys that if you guys ever get the chance, go into your local thrift store. Check out your local thrift store. See if there's something you can find. Try to, uh, try to get some deals off the deal rack. You feel me? Clothing and fashion isn't everything at all, but if you want to look fresh, I, I mean, YOLO, you might as well look fresh, you feel me? Save your money, though. Thank y'all for watching, as always. I love you. It's your boy, Chris Briggs. More videos coming soon. All I have to say is, hey, blessings, 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 and uh, Chris Briggs. Signing out. Yeah. Shit, man.